Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ruby, if you didn't know. And today I'm coming to you guys with a very dry face. Like very, it's very pale and dry. The only thing that's moisturized right now is my lips. Because I wanted to show you guys my skincare routine today. Well, tonight. This is what I do at night. I do this every night. Um, and then I do like in the morning, I'm more, so, well, I'll explain that later. But today I'm gonna show you guys my skincare routine. Yeah, I was just fixing my nose ring. It looked like I was picking my nose, but I wasn't, I swear. I was just fixing my nose ring because I have a bunny here. It's a Playboy bunny, but it, I didn't know it was a Playboy bunny when I got it. I just thought it was a rabbit. But um, it just like, sometimes it just rolls into my nose, you know? So I just like have to roll it back up. So anyway, I just started doing the skincare routine um, probably like, I'm gonna say two weeks ago. And it's actually been helping, I think. I think it's been helping. I haven't been breaking out as much. I have a, a few breakouts right here, um, but that's for a completely different reason. I know exactly why I'm breaking out right there. So let's get started. So I've already washed my face. I've already washed my face, because I, I did it while, I washed my face while I'm in the shower. I just took a shower. So I've already washed my face. Well, not so much on my hair, by the way, because I'm supposed to, I was supposed to bend, bend, refresh my hair, but I haven't been going out, so I haven't done it. So yeah, okay back to the video so i first start off by washing my face i use cerave the cerave Renoi essay cleanser um and i use it twice i wash my face twice with this and then after that well i do it in the shower so after i'm all ready i wash my hands because i moisturize with clean hands and then i start with hyaluronic acid by the ordinary and your face is supposed to be wet when you do this so let me just, okay. So your face is supposed to be wet when you do this. Mind you, okay, I'm not a dermatologist. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not a dermatologist. I'm not somebody who knows a lot about skincare, but I have a friend who knows a lot about skincare. So she's helped me put together this skincare routine uh, because I got the stuff off of like Amazon, like the hyaluronic acid and the, um, the rest of this, like th two of the other things, I got off of Amazon in like a three thing set, and then I just had one of the two, I had two of the other things in my house. So, yeah. But my best friend told me to get hyaluronic acid, and that's how I ended up finding that three step system thing from the ordinary. <laughs> And she helped me to put together this whole routine. She's not a dermatologist either, so you don't have to use it if you don't want to. I'm just showing you what I do every night and what's been helping me. Because I'm going to be really honest with you, I've never had a skincare routine. Like, I've had, like, something of the sort where it was like, oh, you know, moisture, I mean, wash your face with this, moisturize with this. I used to use toner, um, but... I didn't actually know what it did. I just knew that a whole bunch of like YouTubers were using it. They just weren't explaining what they were doing. So yeah, but she told me this one is to like tighten your face. Oh, that's how she explained it. And it's been helping because my skin has been looking like very dull, very dry, very, but at the same time also oily. So I guess applying all this stuff has been kind of balancing it out. I don't know. I really don't know, but it's actually been helping. Okay, so next I use Niacinamide by The Ordinary, which was also part of the three-step thing that I got on Amazon. I'll link it down below, but it's Niacinamide. And then, I close these things so tight. <laughs> and if you know more about skincare, comment down below if you think I'm doing anything wrong. As far as like, how much I put, I don't even know. I was just told, put it on your face. You know what I'm saying? I don't, this is, yeah. This is like a, a free form version of the skincare routine. You know what I mean? So this is this, it's just me just figuring it out. Like, honestly, whatever doesn't work, I'll stop using, but it's been working so far. Like, it's been working so far. Again, I know why I'm breaking out a little bit on my chin. And that'll be handled soon. I've also I've also learned. Well, I've always done this, but I didn't know that that was like a good thing. Uh, to only apply with your face, like don't use your palms. I didn't know. I don't know why. 
okay i don't know why um i just learned that it's like that's what you're supposed to do so i use my fingertips i don't already use my fingertips um next i have vitamin c this from the ordinary vitamin c suspension it's not bad i like like i like it because it's like creamy and it's not like sticky like the other two but i don't know if it has like how do i say this when i sound stupid like rocks in it or like something but it feels kind of like rough on my skin you know like yeah you see that it does that like why does it do that i don't know why it does that i don't know if it's just like it combining with everything but it does that and i don't know what that is like I actually might stop using it to be really honest with you because I don't like that like I don't like that at all it feels weird it feels weird but you know my skin hasn't been breaking out since I've been doing all of these steps so I figured like that's just how it's supposed to react but I don't like that I don't like that at all I don't like how that feels it's like it creates little, like rocks I don't know what my like, little like it's not like an exfoliant or anything so it's not like dripping dead skin off my face i don't know what it's doing but i don't like it <laughs> i don't like that at all that's what i've been doing though that's what i've been doing though anyway after that i use rosehip oil and this is one of the like this is one of the two like those three things like the niacinamide the hyaluronic and the vitamin c were the three things that i got on amazon um i was like a it came as like a set and I had got the rose hip oil. I already had it. I got it from Ulta and I was already using this with some moisturizer. Um, but those are my only two steps. <laughs> those are my only two steps. You know how shiny it look? Yeah. But by the morning, it's like, it's not as intense. And it's like, it just feels really, really good, you know? And then I wash it off. <laughs> So that was the rose tip oil. And the last thing I do is this is CeraVe facial moisturizing lotion with um SPF. That's what it is. Sunscreen in it, right? And it's the a it says AM on it, but I had already bought it and I wasn't buying another one just to try out this thing. So it has it has sunscreen in it. But I do wear it to sleep. I'm probably going to get the pan version later. But this is what I've been using so far. I've been using that. And I put it in this bottle because I mixed it with. It's not up here. But I mixed it with tea tree oil. Because um, I was breaking out a lot. And tea tree oil helps with my breakouts. Um, but I had to dilute it. Because before I was just directly putting tea tree oil on my face. I know. I know. Someone did teach me that though. <laughs> and yeah so i started diluting it with the moisturizer and like i'm mixing it with the moisturizer and it's actually really been helping me um with my breakouts as well so after the rosehip oil i put this moisturizer on and i just rub it in and y'all i'm really i'm really considering stop using that like stopping using that vitamin c but i heard that vitamin c was like really good like when i was researching like skincare routines and things you should put on your skin to help it like not be dull and not be whatever like vitamin c was like the number one thing up there but maybe it's just this brand or maybe it's like because it's mixing with everything but it's like it just like i don't know and this started happening like recently too it just randomly start i just I just gripped the hell out of my throat. It just randomly started um creating those little balls. At first I thought it was the um the moisturizer because it has SPF in it, but that would just create a white cast. Um, except it also doesn't do that to my face. So yeah. And I also also I bring everything down to my neck. Um I don't just leave it up at the top of my face. I bring everything down to my neck. But yeah, I just didn't, I don't like that much. I don't like that at all. I don't like that it does that. But anyway, after that, I'm basically done. That is my skincare routine. Very short, right? Very easy. Yeah, that's how I like it. Short and sweet. That's it. But I do want to show you, I started using these extra strength blemish patches. 
when I get pimples. So if I get pimple, it's a pimple patch. They do work. I just think I might need to find another brand because um, it's kind of like a hit or miss. You know, I want consistency. Um, this is what they look like. They look like this. I tried to find the the little stars that everybody's always using. Um, I couldn't though. I couldn't find it at all. So I just got these circles. <laughs> and they work just fine. I just I think I need to find something else to uh to try. Um because you know sometimes they work and sometimes they don't. So I guess I shouldn't say it works just fine. It works occasionally. Um but I did get these from Walmart and I got everything else from Amazon or Ulta. So yes, but one thing I've learned, skincare, expensive. Expensive. Like expensive. Straight up. Not even gonna lie. Um, there's some other things that I do use for my skin every once in a while. I don't do this all the time. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I do not do a face mask every night. It's these face masks that I got from um from a friend. And like they she got them from Amazon and I actually Wanted to buy these over again because they were actually really good. They come with like different ones and they have like different, pro like it tells you all of the properties and everything on it. And I really like them. I really like them. I'm running out so I need to order some more, but yeah, I really like them. And C, vitamin C. So maybe I just got the wrong vitamin C. Maybe I need to get in like a, a bottle like this one because that little cream, it just don't be doing it for me. Like, it started creating all these little rolls and bumps and stuff like it's pulling stuff up in my face. I don't like that. I don't like that. Mm -mm. No. But I also use this. This this face mask or this face mask. This is a peel off one. This is a clay mask. And, you know, sometimes sometimes you just want a little, a little, a little self-care night, you know? So that's what that's for. That's what that's for. Okay, but y'all, that was it. That was my skincare routine. That was a few extra products that I've used. Um, just to recap, it's a good face wash. I really like it. My best friend put me onto it. It's really good. Um, we have hyaluronic acid. We have niacinamide. We have vitamin C. I don't know. I wouldn't really endorse this that much because y'all saw what it did. It was. You saw them balls too, right? I like that. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Like, if I'm doing this wrong, like, tell me. Like, if I. If I wasn't supposed to put this on after that, or if like I don't know, I'm this is a learning process, but I don't I don't like that it did that. It also is rough, like it feels rough. Like you can feel it on your fingertips. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe y'all feeling something different if y'all have used this. Because the comments and like every time I buy a product on Amazon, they'd be like, like I read the, the reviews and they were like praising this vitamin C, but I just I'm not rocking with it that much. But yeah, this, and then I use CeraVe moisturizer. I'm lying. Next, I use rosehip oil. What? And I like it. I like. I like it. I like this. I, I, I like this. I'll use that for a while, and then I use CeraVe with some tea tree oil mixed into it. Let's see, you know what it looks like. Tea tree oil. Yeah. So that's basically my skincare routine. That's what I do every night. In the morning, I, I just wake up, I wash my face twice, the same CeraVe, and put some moisturizer on. I don't do any of that extra stuff. I just kind of, I don't like all that extra stuff on my face throughout the day. I'm already going to be hot. Don't need it. So, this is a moisturizer. It's good for the day. Come back at night, I do this, and I'm good. You know? And if I have a little pimple, I put on this pimple patch, which I might be changing soon. <laughs> oh my god but thank you guys so much for watching this video if you like it give it a thumbs up and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye ow bye <laughs>